after losing their opening match to South Africa and defeat in Scotland inside 12 overs in their second match, the West Indies were sitting pretty in second spot in Group B, with a healthy net run rate of plus 1.154. But South Africa's demolition of Scotland today by 80 runs catapulted them to the top of the table with four points and a net run rate of plus 1.527. West Indies assistant coach Ryan Austin acknowledged South Africa's result today and indicated the team's wariness of the group standings. Know any girls that, um, that, that I have known for a really long time, a lot of them are pretty confident. Um, when you have a Haley Matthews and a DeAndre Dotton and Stephanie Taylor in your side, you know, it becomes pretty easy, you know, because these girls have a lot of experience. They are already having conversations amongst themselves. They are already... Um, with the practice session tonight going to be, you know, planning for that. So, you know, it's pretty easy with these girls, and uh, I am sure they are confident. And, you know, having said that, Haley hasn't scored any runs as yet, um, so I am pretty sure she's hungry. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm Bangladesh and England better watch out because she's coming, yeah. The surfaces at Charger Stadium have been throwing out surprises to the teams that have played there since the tournament started last Thursday. Austin says the team is banking on their power hitting to counteract the spin-laden lineup of the Bangladesh bowling attack. The team is pretty prepared. Um, you know, we we obviously know that Bangladesh is is basically a spin-based unit, so we already know all these things. But um, with our philosophy, is now we more focus on what we can control. Um, but having said that, uh, we still have that element of power with our batting that, you know, that could counter the spin as well. Mm -hmm. Our strategy is obviously um, based on, if you look at how the our group is set up, um, you know, net run rate is really going to come in to, into a big factor mm -hmm. later down, um, especially, you know, if we win both games against Bangladesh and England. So one of the, the things that we really have to look at is obviously our net run rate and how we go about doing those things mm -hmm. um, coming up, especially in the next game against Bangladesh. So it's, it's, it's pretty, it's, we have to really strategize um, in the next couple of days, to obviously, to, to get off and running. But um, that would be our game plan to at least uh, probably bat first, I mean, bowl first, and then try to hit the lick off the runs as fast as possible. First ball is at 10 a.m. Caribbean time. Nasira Mohammed, TTT Sports.